Hello, my name is Pastor Aaron Powers. I'm the senior pastor at the State Street Church of God in the lovely town of Greensboro, North Carolina. Today I want to ask you the question, are you concerned over the future? Do you know what's going to happen to you when you die? Well, I'm going to answer that question to you, uh, for you today from the book of John, chapter 14, verses 1 through 3, where it reads, Let not your heart be troubled. You believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself, that where I am, there you may be also. If you're concerned over the future, you've got an outstanding resource in the one man, Jesus Christ. There's one mediator between God and men, the man Christ Jesus, and he wants to be your friend. He wants to know you and have a relationship with you in an intimacy like you've never known. He wants to love you and provide for you and be your friend in time of trouble, in time of heartache. He's always there. And if you're concerned over the future, Jesus has just told us that he goes to prepare a place for us. Now, if you're worried about whether or not Jesus' word is true, I can tell you that he certified his word by his own resurrection from the dead. He told his disciples, he told them that they're going to destroy this temple. He said, and in three days, I'll raise it up again. On the third day, he did exactly that. Praise the Lord. As the sun woke up the earth on that third day, on that Easter morning, that first Easter morning, the birds began to chirp. I believe with all my heart that Michael, the, the archangel, sat down upon the stone and he, he told everybody there he'd come to give the master a wake-up call. Today, that same risen Savior is preparing a place. You can have real estate on a golden avenue with your name on the mailbox. Praise God. Today is your day. Will you accept the Lord as your Savior? Now, I'm going to tell you, if you don't know how, it's very simple. I can tell you how. First, you must ask. Second, you must believe. That's it. Acts chapter 2 and verse 21 and Romans chapter 10 verse 13 tells us, Whosoever calleth upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Ask and believe. That's the formula. Jesus said, I stand at the door and knock. So let me tell you how to ask. All you have to do is say, Lord Jesus, come into my heart. Lord, I ask you today to be my Savior and I'll walk with you and I'll talk with you and I'll have relationship with you on a daily basis. Today, Lord, because I've asked you into my heart, because I believe that you've done what I've asked, I am saved. And now you've got a name on a deed, on a house, on Golden Avenue. Praise God, where you're never going to get tired, where you're never going to grow old, where the problems of life fade away and every need is supplied by the man, Christ Jesus. That brings me joy. That brings me peace. That brings me hope. And that is my promise. Jesus always keeps his promises. And if I don't go by the way of the grave to this place called heaven, if I don't go by the way of the grave, I can surely go with him when the Lord comes again. Behold, the Lord himself shall come with ten thousands of his saints. The Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel and the trump of God. The dead in Christ shall rise first, and those of us which are alive and remain shall be called up, hallelujah, in the air. So shall we ever be with the Lord. We can take him at his word because his word was his promise, his promise fulfilled when he was resurrected, when you're saved, and surely at his second coming. Today is your day. I'm going to ask you, if you would, to watch Christian programming like TCT because, in my opinion, this is the best programming that you can ever put before your eyes. It comes forth on this television station, TCT. This station will bring you programming that will, that will uplift you, that will help you, that will, that will give you peace in time of trouble, that will cause you to, to deepen your relationship with God, that will draw you closer to Him through sound biblical teaching, through, through questions and answers like ask the pastor. When you have a question and, and you can't seem to find the answer, you can call in and there's a panel of, of pastors that will answer your questions to the best of their ability based upon their years of service and based upon their Bible knowledge. Today, thank you for tuning in to TCT. Thank you so much for, for taking the time to, to ask Jesus to come into your heart. Thank you so much for owning Golden Avenue Real Estate today. Today is your day, and God bless you is my prayer. 